Welcome to my amazing review today. So in today's review video, I'm going to show you one of the lean shortener and lean tracker software I'm currently using right now in order to replace my free Bitly versions. And I will tell you what are the functionality in compared to the free Bitly version so that you can also do the same as well. So what I love about, I actually been using this uh, Switchy for about a week. What I love about it and then the reasons that I'm upgrading it is because it has a lean tracker, meaning it can actually insert the pixels for every links that I shorten, which it wasn't being covered in the Bitly. So for the past, past five months, I've been using Bitly in my business as well as I'm using Bitly for the previous years for my other business as well. The free version is really good. It served my purpose of shorten the link. Um, but it did not serve another purpose because it did not help me to pixel the link. I do not actually able to see a lot more details or analytics or I can I cannot even um, tell Bitly, tell for Bitly that where these people come from, right? So that's why I dive into this Switchy and also I got a Switchy as well because it's a lifetime deal. Um, I only get it, I only get it about, let me see, $39 for a lifetime, like for about 30,000 clicks per month and eight custom domains and unlimited links. So that's why I bought it in order to test it. So I do, I did some due diligence before I bought it because I want to make sure that I'm using the right tool, right? I don't know, I don't want to waste time. So I've been using for one week, I absolutely love it. That's why I want to show you guys the main difference if let's say you're using Bitly free version or using tiny URL version, what is the advantage that Switchy give you um, that Bitly doesn't have in the free version? So right now you're looking at my Switchy dashboard, right? So in the dashboard, firstly, I really love the fact that we are able to categorize accordingly to the types of folders. Like you can categorize according to, you know, the different business you have or like a different project that you're working on, right? So let's say right now I want to create a new link. All I need to do is just to create a new link. When you're here, that is really, is really cool here. So let's assume that I want to, I want to shorten this link client manic machine blueprint. So this blueprint is actually, um, we help you to transform your Facebook profile to get more unlimited leads, more clients and more sales for business is one of my product, but it's too long the name. So that's why I want to shorten it by Switchy. So let's say I shorten my Switchy. So let's see what other, yeah, let me move myself away. <laughs> so. I'm going to refresh here. You're going to see this photo, but I don't really like this photo, right? So I want to change it to only particular for this link. So all I need to do is just to select a photo that I really like, upload it. Not only I'm able to customize to the new photo as well, I'm able to customize to our new headline, like get more clients and sales for your business without ads spend okay and here i want to maintain or you want to change also can okay here's the cool part this part is something that tiny url and bitly free version can't do it for you the second part which i love is because i'm able to customize the dome the link and the domain according to my so i the, it is very easy to edit so i just follow instructions i actually uh, change it from the cloudflare um, so right now, every link shortener will have my name, my domain and my name, so which I really love it. So let's say this get CMM. So one extra thing is that you can add UTM tags. So if let's say you do not know what is UTM tags here, right? Maybe for our same link, you have run different campaigns. So some campaigns, you actually run it in YouTube. Let's say it's YouTube channel. Some campaigns, you actually run it in your Facebook profile. It's not even your Facebook page, it's your Facebook profile. Or some other campaign is actually from Instagram. You can actually write it down here by whichever link you're you're able to know how many people click from this source, how many people click from YouTube, how many uh, people click from Facebook profile, and how many people click from Facebook Live. So for this purpose, I'm going to share this, uh, you know, like this is a Facebook profile campaign. profile yeah whichever it makes sense to you right so it's facebook so here is another cool part that you are able to add the pixels this is a very very important if you are running facebook ads definitely this is the place that you do not want to miss out because additional things is that not only you shorten the link you have the ability to being captured by other pixels which include not only facebook twitter linkedin google ads snapchat whatever you can think about it Quora, even quora right and then when I only added three pixels that I have, so right now I'm going to pick like this two, right? 
and you can add more of course and then after that if let's say you want to photo categorize you can have a tag here you can select the photo folder here here i there are some other uh, different different things that you can play around so let's click get my link so link is created so meaning when i share this to someone else right let's type it Switchy is able to retarget them and pixel them in my pixel. So what is so good about pixels when we run ads? Firstly, we can create a lot of look like audience, which is very, very important and is able to enable us to do retargeting more efficiently. So, so that's the reason why I love to switch so much. So let's just now I click one time already, right? You see here, I can see the stats. So here we have different other things you can do as well. So let me show the stats, right? Oh, sorry, not this link. I think it's the other one. Uh, let me see. I put it under CMM. Yeah, this one. Yeah, it show one as well. So let's see the stats. So the stat is really, really very detailed. I want you guys to see it. Like this is a link. I, I saw my name. I'm so happy <laughs> because it's customized. Um, how many users, how many re re referrals, devices and country? You can see referral, Malaysia, you know where they are, you know what, which browser, which operating system, which the UTM I use, I put Facebook profile, Instagram. So it's retargeting pixel is being this two that I selected. It's very, very detailed, which helps you to not only save your ads course because you're able to retarget it more efficiently. There is another cool part. I want to share this trick with you guys. This link shortener, the other powerful uh, function is that you can even track links that you link, you, you bring others to third party. Okay, let me give you a scenario. Let's say you see a post, a content that is really so good, so beneficial to your potential leads, right? Uh, let's say it's this, this article from Social Media Explorer. Okay, so you want to share it out. So usually what you will do, if let's say you're using Bitly, you will just go to, you know, your Bitly, you just shorten it, you have a bit.ly slash something, right? And you share the content. What problem here is that you can't really pixel them, right? So, but then with switching, even though it's like a third party kind of content, when you create a link from this third party content, right? Let, let's see. You can even pixel the third party content. Does it make sense? So meaning, meaning even though it's not an article that is being written by me, it's a third party, I'm still able to actually pixel them, right? So I, I just add them to my pixel. I can even change to my own photo. Like let's say right now, it's Social Media Explorer content. Here they should populate a photo by Social Media Pixel, which is totally irrelevant, right? You can even put your own photo if you want <laughs> let's for example of course this this picture i simply pick right just pick one that is relevant maybe with your photo and i said this is the top 10 tips tips by social media explorer top five tips by something and then all this you can just fill in directly okay you have the ability to pixel them and then you create a short link. So if let's say you were to share a, such a beneficial article that you know that your potential client is going to click, why not pixel them? So one thing is that when you pixel them, you're able to retarget them with your own product or own offer. That's one number one. But let's assume that you have a lot of people clicking on link. You can even produce a look alike audience in order to for your Facebook campaigns to work even more efficiently. You're going to save a lot more with the Facebook ads. Does this make sense to you guys? So my regret of not getting switchy is my regret. My regret of getting switchy is that I think I got it too late because if let's say I got it five months earlier, a lot of people have been clicking not only my website link, my YouTube link. It's all I produce it using Bitly. My even my strategy calling. If let's say I have used Switchy to produce them to link, uh, shorten their link and to insert my Facebook pixel, I would have a really huge audience. Which I not only I can retarget them so efficiently, save my ad costs. I can even produce a look a lot audience based on these people. Does it make sense? So that's why I think these are the part that about Switchy that I love, and not forgetting that it's really, really, really very affordable. Like. One time lifetime there is only $39 uh, for one lifetime. And for me, if let's say you're a newbie, eight custom domains, 30,000 clicks is one uh, is well enough. I do not know, 
I do not know when this um when this is going to end soon. This one I'm not so sure, but I really love this product because the earlier that I'm able to retarget them, the better off I am because I can create a look alike audience that is more efficient for my Facebook ads. And also it's it creates more branding to me because right now no longer people are seeing Bitly link, but rather they are seeing a Junlo link. It's very easy to customize as well. Um yeah, so I have yeah, it's unlimited pixels anyway. So let's compare with the Bitly. So Bitly, how much? $29 per month. Um there is some link creation 1500 link clicks unlimited as well so you can actually do the comparison but definitely lifetime deal i i don't see anyone else there offering that but in the future also here mark coming soon they will have the ability to add team members i am not so sure when whether they will add but right now i'm just happy with how i'm using it so let's say right now you're using bitly free version the question is should you use switchy right now I will throw back the answer back to you because it depends on whether you have the budget. If let's say you do not have the budget of $39, I would say that it's all right. If let's say you are just starting out, you're happy with Bitly, then just go on, all right? And if let's say you are just not planning to do any Facebook ads, you, don't, you do not need the detailed statistics that Switchy is providing to you, you're happy with Bitly free version, just stay on to Bitly free version, no problem. If let's say you have a plan to actually start your Facebook ads in the near future, definitely switch to Switchy because you are able to retarget it and you are able to create a look alike audience which makes your Facebook ads more efficiently and some more you can actually use other people really good article and then kind of pixel yourself inside, right? So why not? So if let's say, um, I actually got this deal from AppSumo. If let's say you really love my real video here and you plan to get uh, from my link, my affiliate link, I'm going to put it down below. So here's the catch. If let's say you get from my link, my affiliate link, using a brand new email in AppSumo, it must be a brand new email, right? It cannot be an existing account. Brand new email account in AppSumo, you are going to get get free bonus for me. I have a lot of different type of bonuses I'm able to offer, but I do not know what you need. So uh, you can chat with me. I'm going to put my messaging link down below. If let's say you're not so sure whether you should switch or you're not so sure what kind of bonuses I have, you can always chat with me. We can chat even further. Even though you are not planning to get switchy in the end it doesn't matter right i can just based on your situation i can let you know whether you should switch to switchy or you should actually invest in something else that is more important for you if let's say you have limited budget so number one one bonus i have is that i have this facebook lifetime tool that i'm able I, I, you are able to use this facebook lifetime tool right to spy the facebook groups that your friends is joining and also you're able to filter your friends list according to how active they are whether they um they engage with you in pm and comments on whether they message you if let's say they are not you might as well just delete them using one button everything can happen in less than 10 seconds you do not need to delete one by one yourself all right the reason that we are deleting inactive friends is that we want to make sure that our friend list stay focused where uh, Facebook will feel that uh, they have an algorithm to read that our content is more likely to be able to shown to uh, friends who actually engage with us okay so I have one tool or I have other bonuses that I can give you say I can produce like Usually in my live video, I always have those brand intro, right? right? Like my logo and then my website. So if let's say that is important to you, I can produce that video as well for your bonus as well. But it must be a brand new account on AppSumo. And I'm going to put my link down below. And just, I know it's ironic, right? I'm, right now I'm talking about link shortener. But for my affiliate link down below, I'm not going to put a shortener link because this is what happened last time last time i was so hardworking in producing really really good contents asking people to buy a product from AppSumo. i used a link shortener in the end my 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 sales did not capture which is a big loss to me but it doesn't matter so i emailed the support of the AppSumo and a affiliate company they said that ask me not to use link shortener so i know it's ironic so for this app zoom uh for this deal right i'm not going to use link shortener but i'm going to use one link shortener for you to message me if let's say you're using a brand new account you're buying this you can claim your bonuses by clicking the messenger link below so don't worry remember you don't invest in tools that you do not need okay so just if let's say you're planning you, you after you see this video you think it's really awesome then feel free to chat so i look forward to see you guys tomorrow then take care bye